Hey everybody, welcome to the Wolf Pit. Today I'm gonna make three cheese stuffed shells. Simple, easy, and very delicious. So let's get started. I'm gonna start by adding salt to a pot of boiling water. And now I'm gonna add dry jumbo shells. And now I'm gonna boil the shells for about seven minutes. I don't wanna fully cook them. They'll finish cooking as they bake. While the shells are cooking, I'm gonna get our three cheese filling ready. I'm gonna combine two large eggs, dried oregano, dried parsley. If you have fresh parsley, that's even better. A little kosher salt. Black pepper. Ricotta cheese. Parmesan cheese. And finally, mozzarella cheese. And now you want to thoroughly combine all the ingredients. And I found that a potato masher works much better than a spatula. And now I've drained the partially cooked shells. Also, by partially cooking them, it leaves them a little bit firmer and easier to stuff. And now I'm going to stuff each shell with a heaping tablespoon of the three cheese filling. And now in a 9 by 13 casserole dish, I'm going to add one cup of my favorite spaghetti sauce. You can use regular spaghetti sauce, tomato sauce, or meat sauce, whatever you like. And now I'm going to lay out all of the stuffed shells on top of the spaghetti sauce. Once all of the shells are laid out, I'm going to add some more spaghetti sauce to the top. And now I'm going to cover the dish with aluminum foil, and these go into a 350 degree oven for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes in a 350 degree oven, remove the aluminum foil and add a light layer of mozzarella cheese. And then it goes back into a 350 degree oven for about 10 minutes until the cheese is nice and melted and bubbly. And you should let this cool for about 10 minutes before serving, but we couldn't wait. And that's all there is to making three cheese stuffed jumbo shells. If this looks like something you'd like to try at home, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you give this a try, and I'll see you next time.